Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how you can install Steam without admin rights. So firstly what you have to do is just simply download the Steam EXE over here. So to download the EXE what you have to do is just simply go to Google Chrome. Then just simply type in Steam. Then open the Steam website. Then just simply click on install Steam over here. Then just simply click again install Steam. Now just simply choose a location and click on save and the application will be downloaded. So in order for you to actually start the installation, what you have to do is just simply create a new folder. Then just simply drag your exe into that folder. Now just simply go inside that folder and create a new text document. Now just simply open that text document. Now in that text document, just simply paste what is given to you in the description box below. Then after pasting, just simply go to file and save it. Now, just simply close the text document now. And now what you have to do is just simply go to view over here. Then go to show and enable the file name extension over here. Make sure it is enabled because without that, you won't be able to see the last part over here, which is .txt. So just simply go view, show file name extensions. And then you will be able to see the extensions of every file. Now, what you have to do is with the file is just simply right click on that text document. Then just simply click on rename. Now select the entire thing and remove it. Now you can give any name. Let's go with play. And the important part that is in the ending of whatever name you choose, it should be dot B A T. So after writing that, just simply click anywhere in the screen and a pop-up window will appear. Then in that, just simply click yes. And now you have created a bad file. Now it will automatically start the setup without the admin privileges. But make sure to keep the setup and the bad file in the same folder because if they are in different folders, it won't work. So just simply double click on the bad file and the setup is launched. Now you can just simply install Steam like any normal installation. So that's it and thank you for watching and do like and subscribe to my channel and take care.